So I think the reason why some of you are not subscribed to my channel is because of this woman. Oh, wow, why aren't you subscribed to my YouTube channel? Eh? Hey. When I subscribe now, banks will start deducting small, small from my account. Abby. You have to... Subscription is free now. Where did you hear that from? I'm not subscribing. Subscription is absolutely free. Again and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Noye and I'm a Nigerian teacher. I live and work in Lagos, Nigeria. In today's episode, so I'm going to be doing my first Q and A. You know what happened? Your girl got attacked. My goodness. I know a couple of people who have asked me why I haven't done my Q and A that they would like to get to know me. They've seen my videos. They've seen how passionate I am about what I do, but they haven't seen a get to know me video and they're wondering why. They had the time, honestly, believe me, to search through all my videos to find out that I haven't done a Q and A. My goodness. So there are 20 questions in all and I'm going to answer all of these questions. So these questions will help you to get to know me. So welcome to my channel. If you're not subscribed already, please hit that subscribe button. Tap on the notification bell. That way you'll get notified when I drop my next video. <music> But one question is, what is your full name? <laughs> My full name is Chinonyelum Laura Balogun. Okay, Chinonyelum Laura Balogun. Second question, what's the meaning of your name? The meaning of my name Chinonyelum is God is with me. Chinonyelum, God is with me. That's the full meaning. That's the meaning of my name. Okay. The third question is, where are you from? I'm a Nigerian. I say that in all my videos. So if you're watching from across the globe, I'm a Nigerian. Proudly Niger. I'm a Nigerian, but I'm from Anambra State. So I'm of the Igbo tribe. Igbo tribe, yeah. <laughs> so that Igbo's, Igbo's, don't come to say that I did not pronounce it correctly. Igbo. Mm -hmm. I'm of the Igbo tribe from Anambra State. If you want to get to my village, okay, I'm from Newi. Hey. <laughs> Felicia Scraft, Nazom's Corner, this is Space, Banter with NJ. Come and carry your sister. <laughs> I'm from Newi, Otolo Newi in Anambra State. So that has answered that number three questions so let's move to number four where did you grow up my number four question where did you grow up i was born bred buttered sardined and eaten by everybody in lagos state so <laughs> i was born in lagos state i grew up in lagos state i currently am in lagos state spend the better part of my life in lagos state on a scale of one to ten rate your childhood i'd say that my childhood on a scale of one to ten is 9.5 yeah why I was a child and I was a child when I was a child. Everything about being a child, I was a child. I did not experiment as a child. I did not try adult stuff, right? I was purely a child and truly a child. So that's why I said 9.5, I was totally a child, yeah. Now, what's your favorite sport? And that would be volleyball. And, and that's because that's one of the games that I have played before. So I'm not really a sport lover or a fan of sports like that. But if you would ask me for my favorite sport, it would be volleyball. Yeah. My favorite book. Ah, next question. My favorite book would be by Bill Hybels. And the book is Who You Are When No One Is Looking. I read that book. It's on character formation. I seem to know every word on every page of that book because I've read it like 50 billion times. But it's a character formation book and it's helped me a lot. And that was where I learned about the lead gratification there's so much about that book i love it thank you that's my favorite book my favorite color my favorite color if you can pick this color yeah gray ash charcoal gray anything within that family that's my color favorite color okay nigerian language is spoken nigerian language is spoken i speak the three major nigerian languages that's Igbo, yoruba and hausa but my hausa is the least of the three yeah so a typical jamila <laughs> don't come for me a typical house person will still criticize my house but it's still on the basic level so what's your biggest accomplishment my biggest accomplishment is that it's not to give up honestly that's what i've really achieved not to give give up and to keep moving my biggest accomplishment then I, my biggest regret my biggest regret is that at some point in my life i'd listened to people 
yeah i think that was one of my biggest regrets ah why do you want to do this yeah you should do it if you try this blah 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 hmm, better don't <laughs> and here we are i've tried a lot of things and i'm glad that that regret is not holding me down now i've moved on i have and i haven't given up so one of my biggest regrets is that at some point in my life i've listened to people and they have confused me so i've learned now as i've grown older and i've grown older that listening to people <laughs> especially when you shouldn't is a no-no okay what drives you ah, my major driving first would be excellent yeah you're wondering why excellence oh you're not even an excellent person thank you but i decided to pick excellence or i have always lived my life to always um, achieve excellence and the reason why i do that is that if i am not an excellent person right about now i know that if i continue to do excellent things i'll become an excellent person so that was why i even named my channel the excellent teacher i want to be an excellent person so it's an intention it's something that i want to achieve i'm not there yet but i'll surely get there so the next question what's your favorite drink my favorite drink will be water honestly i'm a teetotaler for the record sake yes i'm a teetotaler um i don't do alcohol personal reasons right okay and then i do not buy drinks with my money the only time you'll find me drinking anything yeah any safe drink would be when i attend a, an event or a program and then i'm offered a drink but i don't buy with my money so my favorite drink honestly is water my favorite food uh my nigerian food i like to have nigerian soup especially a greasy soup yeah and pounded yam basically do i have a favorite food i don't think so but a greasy soup and pounded yam is something i may want to sit to eat so what's your favorite place in the world to visit oh there's this place i've always read about and researched about and that's seashells I i'd love to visit seashells one day or uh, probably the caribbean island you know just visit this place that i've imagined before yeah oh the next question are you married oh yeah i'm married i'm a married married woman <laughs> okay yeah i'm married that has answered that question the next question do you have children yes i have children i have three children i have a girl and two boys so i'm a married woman with three children <laughs> then the next one why teaching hmm, this question is a question that has been directed to me at some point why teaching in fact some of my teachers while i was in school have asked me this question why teaching why 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 okay reason is because uh, the best way that i express myself is through learning so teaching has helped me learn teaching has opened up my eyes to learning and then i'm somebody who likes to express myself by, by speaking yes naturally if you've watched my videos you can tell that i'm somebody who naturally likes to do speaking so i do mc i do voiceovers i talk so but i think that if i want to keep speaking or keep talking teacher would help me then if i would like to impact life touch somebody be an influence then teaching is it okay then i hope that has answered the question for teaching and learning so my next question is where did you school okay primary school lagos secondary school ninja state all in nigeria <laughs> tertiary institution okay college of education lagos university Enugu state university of nigeria then um, youth service zamfara then i came back to lagos professional postgraduate courses lagos other advanced courses lagos then online courses um, across the globe online <laughs> i hope that has answered that question thank you so much if you're interested in that i hope that has answered that question then favorite youtubers hmm. my favorite youtubers are in the comment section they know themselves so if you see the symbol and the logo they are the ones they're my favorite youtubers they are right there in my comment section and they're also in the description box so if you're a new youtuber these 20 questions can help you add like you to also try it or if you are a youtuber that has started without doing a q and a i think it's important that you do a q and a right about now so people that watch your video can get to know you that's the reason why you want to do your q and a do not be afraid take that bold step and do your q and a and i hope these 20 questions can also guide you if you're interested you may use all these questions i'm going to put the questions on the screen as i 
say them out so thank you very much for watching my q a and i'll see you very soon in the next video so before you click out of this video i'd like you to do me a favor click on the subscribe button tap on the notification bell that way you'll get notified when i drop my next video so if you're new to my channel click on the subscribe button tap on the notification bell like it comment and share thank you